Hi, and welcome to another episode of The Great Debate. He's Andy Cohen. I'm Dave Agnoni. Thanks for joining us. Our topic for today is 3% annual growth, the new normal for promo product sales. Andy Cohen, what do you think? No, I don't think so, Dave. I think that uh, the promotional products industry has more growth than that in it, more ceiling growth. Certainly, you look at uh, at trends like uh, event marketing, the mm-hmm. live event industry that has uh, has sort of exploded in the last five to ten years. That's something that will continue to grow. Personalization, websites like Zazzle and Custom Inc., those are having an effect on this industry in positive ways, in ways right. that will continue to make it grow. And so I, th- I think that there's plenty more. You also just look at the expansion of what I'll call non-traditional advertising methods. Sure. Promotional products fall into that, and that's something that will continue to expand as uh, as time goes on. All right, Andy, then why in six of the last seven years have sales gone down? I mean, that's a trend, right? So we were up at like 8%. Well, sales have not the last... gone down. The growth rate, you're okay, saying. Okay, the growth rate. I'm down. looking at that chart. You're right. right. Sales overall have increased, but the rate's gone down 2 3% the right. last They've couple of years. increased every year. So these trends you're talking about, why are these trends not well, having an effect on the rate? I, I think that they are having an effect. I think that the industry could have been worse off if not for these trends. Maybe mm-hmm. that there is a mature maturity to the traditional promotional products world in the sense that all of these other areas are maybe non-traditional and are helping it to grow. So 3% growth, which is what I believe we had last year to make a $23 billion yeah. industry, that's higher than GDP by double. Sure. And it you know, is better than most industries had last year. So I would say that that's expanding at a rate that's quicker than, than most industries in the, in, in the economy. You know what's non-traditional and is really working well? Digital advertising. Okay, that's something oh, that's exploding. Well that's exploding. Mm-hmm. Okay, sure, yeah. that's taking I think dollars away from the promo products industry. Mm-hmm. Where yeah. are all the it, mobile? I don't think it's taking from promo, from, from, from promotional. It's products. taking from advertising. It's taking from from mainstream. Where do you think media, it's taking? For sure. Where do you think it's taking money from? I think TV and radio. Yeah, I think more mainstream advertising. If you look at those, those areas are falling. Yeah. Promotional products isn't falling. It hasn't fallen since the recession back in two thousand nine. So. There's no there's no retraction in this yeah. market like there is in other ad and marketing areas. There hasn't been here. I think a big story is that market shares is sort of being pushed around. You don't have the real growth. You have companies taking clients from other companies, but you're not seeing that large growth, the, the influx of new clients that you have to have to really boost that growth rate. I think that's a, a big story here. You disagree with that? I do because I think that those there is an influx of those clients, and that's pushing it actually to a 3% level. So can we go further than that? I believe that was your question. Yes, I think we can because of well, these other trends. Well, I said it's a new normal. Is 3% the new normal? 3% is not bad, but I, is it the new normal? I, I don't think it, it – That the question implies uh, uh, uh. The question implies that that's always going to be the yeah. way it is. I don't think that that's the case. I think that it has more growth in it than that. I think until companies in this industry, distributors, start acting more like agencies, I think you're going to see 3% as sort of that normal. I also think that you're not seeing enough companies using technology, especially in mobile. Where, where are the mobile and responsive design websites? Mm-hmm. Where are they? I just don't see them. Until companies start using them more, until those technologies become the new normal, I think you're going to see 3 3 3.5% as the capped number. That could be. That could be. But I think that those are also potential potential growth areas for companies in this industry. So I think ones that do jump on that and become ad, uh, like agencies, like marketing mm-hmm. and ad agencies, yeah, they'll probably go f- grow faster than others which will improve the growth rate. I hope it happens. I'm just not sure it's going to happen. Andy says, no, 3% is not the new normal. I say, yes, it is, at least for the time being. Tell us what you think. Send us a tweet at ASI Central. For Andy, I'm Dave. Thanks, as always, for watching The Great Debate. We'll see you next time.